Hi, I'm Becca, and this is my husband, Gabe. That's me. Welcome to the podcast celebrating Jack Russell Terrier Dogs. And all the joys of companionship with canines of every kind. Each week, we'll explore all the heartfelt, humbling, and hilarious stories that only dog parents can truly relate to. We're Jack Russell Parents. Hey there, puppy parents of pups big and small. And huge. Yes, there are some huge dogs out there. Dogs whose stature matches the enormous attitude of Jack Russell Terriers. Some of those huge dogs are fictitious and are a bit crimson in hue, would you say? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I would say that. Speaking of ruby-tinged dogs, technology has finally caught up with our childhood imaginations. At long last, a live-action version of Clifford the Big Red Dog. It looks like a whole lot of fun. It sure does. And here's Paramount's official description of the movie. When middle schooler Emily Elizabeth, played by the super-talented Darby Camp, meets a magical animal rescuer, played by the legendary John Cleese, who gifts her a little red puppy. But she never anticipated waking up to find a giant 10-foot hound in her small New York apartment. And while her single mom is away on business, Emily and her fun but impulsive uncle set out on an adventure that will keep you on the edge of your seat as our heroes take a bite out of the Big Apple. Based on the beloved (laughs) Scholastic book character, Clifford will teach the world how to love big. You actually shed some tears while watching the trailer. I did. That part where Darby tells Clifford people don't like things that are different. Then Clifford lies on the ground and puts his face on his paw. And someone says, what's he doing? And Darby says, I think he's trying to be small. And then Clifford cries a little and it just gets me in all my feelings. Yeah, me too. I don't want anybody to feel small. (laughs) And that moment alone shows that the filmmakers have perfectly encapsulated the heart and the soul of the Clifford series, which is about acceptance and forgiveness and loving someone, not despite their differences, but because of them. And that's really what our podcast is about, too. We love Carson, even when he's wreaking absolute havoc on our home and city. (laughs) Yes, even the city. (laughs) He's lovable no matter how much trouble he gets into. And as Emily Elizabeth says at the end of the first Clifford book, you can keep all your small dogs, you can keep all your black, white, brown, and spotted dogs. I'll keep Clifford. Wouldn't you? See, Carson, no matter what, we're keeping you. Whether you like it or not. He does like it. He loves his mama. (laughs) Just like you'll love the movie version of Clifford the Big Red Dog in theaters now. You know, I found the best way to meet new people is through our mutual love of dogs. People love sharing their dog stories with other puppy parents and introducing their dogs to us and vice versa. Every time we take Carson for a walk, new friendships are born. I know, right? Like people cross the street, even come out of their homes to make Carson's acquaintance. But we can't take him everywhere. Unfortunately, no. But that's when our Jack Russell parents attire takes effect. Cute holiday prints like fall in love with a Jack Russell. I'm thankful for my Jack Russell. All I want for Christmas is a Jack Russell. And puppies make the season merry and bright are the perfect way to celebrate the season and your adorable pup. So are you a proud puppy parent that wants to connect with other puppy parents? Or do you simply like super cute doggy themed attire to go with your cozy leggings or heavy coat? Either way, we have what you need at the Jack Russell Parent Store. All our awesome prints come in a variety of t-shirts, hoodies, baby onesies, coffee mugs, and even face masks. Your choice. To join the doggy squad, check out all the rad merch options at jackrussellparents.com. Simply click on shop at the top and place your order. Happy holidays, puppy parents. (laughs) 
Did you enjoy this episode? Did you learn from the content? Or did you just have a good, relatable laugh? Well, now what? It's time to subscribe, follow, keep listening, and give a positive review on the Apple Podcast app. Then share the podcast with other puppy parents. This will allow us to connect you and your friends with fun, dog-loving content week after week. Until next time, this is Becca and Gabe, the Jack Russell parents. Say bye, Carson. (coughs) We'd love to connect with you online at jackrussellparents.com or on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter at JRT Podcasts. That's at JRT for Jack Russell Terrier Podcast. The Jack Russell Parents Podcast is produced by Earball Audio. Jack Russell Parents is brought to you in part by Super Chewer. From the makers of BarkBox, Super Chewer is a themed monthly delivery of toys and treats made especially for dogs who play harder and demand a challenge. Simply go to jackrussellparents.com and click the Super Chewer link to enjoy their great offers while also supporting our podcast. Mm